Welcome viewers, in this video we will see the details about the derived gates. Subscribe the channel for more videos and notification. Soft copy of this material available in the drive. Link is given in the description box. Now we will go to the topic derived, der derived gates. So there are two types of gates available. One is basic gate. Basic gate means R gate, AND gate and NOT gate are basic gates. From this basic gate we are derived the other gates. That is why it is called a derived gates. NAND gate, NOR gate, XOR gate and XNOR gate are coming under derived gates. That is derived from the basic gates. First you will see the NAND gate. So the NAND gate is nothing but a combination of AND gate and NOT gate. One AND gate and NOT gate is connected in series. So this is a symbol for the NAND gate. So this, is this buffer, this small circle is there. So it indicates it is a NAND gate. If the small circle is not there, mean it is a AND gate, right? So, what is the nature of this NAND gate? The output is high only when the one of the input is low, right? If any one input is low, then only we will get the high output, right? So, this is the symbol small circle indicates is a NAND gate. What is the expression for this? Y equal to A dot B the whole bar, right? AND gate means A dot B. NAND gate means A dot B the whole bar, right? AND gate with NOT gate is connected in series so that A dot B the whole bar. The nature is any one of the input is low, then only we will get the high output. Now we will see the truth table. The two inputs are there A and B. Output is Y. Because of two input, we have four combinations 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, 1, 1. If it is 0, 0, what is the value of 0, 0? 0 into 0 means 0, but while taking complement, it becomes 1. 0, 1. 0, 1 means 0, 1, 0 into 1 also 0. While taking complement, it becomes 1. Then 1, 0. 1 into 0 also 0, but while taking complement, it becomes 1. Then 1 into 1. 1 into 1 is 1, but while taking complement, it becomes 0. Right? So, this is the truth table. 0, 0 means 1. 0, 1 means 1, 1, 0 means 1, 1, 1 means 0. See this, the output is high when any one of the input, minimum any one of the input should be low. In this, both the inputs are high so that we are getting the low output. So, that is given. The output is high only when one of the input is low. So, what is the application? It can be used to implement any digital circuit. So, this is also called a universal gate. NAND gate also is a universal gate. Any type of gate operation can be implemented with NAND gate. So that it is called a universal gate. Now we will go to the next type, NOR gate. The NOR gate is nothing but a combination of R gate in series with the NOT gate. Right? The NOR gate is the combination of R gate with the NOT gate. This is a symbol for this, the two inputs A and B, the output is Y. This small circle indicates it is a NOR gate. If the small circle is not there, means it is a R gate. With this circle, it is treated as NOR gate. Then what is the nature of this circuit? The output is high, one high when all the inputs are low. In previous case, any one input is low in NAND gate. In R gate, all the inputs should be low, then only we will get the high output. What is the expression for this? Y equal to A plus B the whole bar. R gate means A plus B. NOR gate means A plus B the whole bar. Right? Now we will see the truth table. The input available A and B. The output is Y. A and B two inputs are there. Four combination available. 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, 1, 1. First we will see 0, 0. 0 plus 0 means 0. But while taking complement it becomes 1. 0 plus 1. 0 plus 1 means 1. While taking complement, it becomes 0. 1 plus 0 is 1. But while taking complement, it becomes 0. Then 1 plus 1. 1 plus 1 also 1. But while taking complement, it becomes 0. See this only when both the inputs are 0, we got the high output. Right? Otherwise, for all other cases, we got the low output. Right? Only when both the inputs 0 plus 0 means 0, while taking complement, it becomes 1. Right? For all other cases, we got the low output. So, what is the nature? 
the output is high when all the inputs are low. So this NOR gate also coming under the universal gate. Any type of gating operation can be performed by using NOR gate. So both and NAT gate as well as NOR gate. So the application is it can be used to implement any digital circuit. Any operation for example AND operation, OR operation, NOT operation, NOR operation or NAND operation. Any operation can be implemented with the NOR gate or NAND gate that is called a so that it is called a universal gates NAND gate and NOR gate are called a universal gates now we'll go to the special type of gate exclusive OR gate XR gate exclusive OR XR gate what is that XR gate so this is the OR gate and one one more line is drawn it's called a XR gate right this OR gate is there this is a symbol for OR gate if you draw one more line it indicates the XR gate what is the nature of this XR gate the output is high only when odd number of inputs are high odd number of input that is either 1 3 5 like that right so this is the nature of the XR gate the output is high only when odd number of inputs are high so this is a symbol a B and the output is Y right what is the expression a equal to a plus B the circle is that is a R operation that is nothing but a bar b plus a b bar a bar b plus a b bar right this is the operation so this plus with the circle is nothing but xr gate right now we'll see the truth table input is a b output is y because of two inputs we have four combinations 0 0 0 1 1 0 1 1 if the both the inputs are 0 what will happen 0 a is also 0 b is also 0 means this B is 0, A bar means 1, so it becomes 0. A is 0, B bar means 1, that also 0. So 0 plus 0, it will give 0 only. 0 and 1, if A is 0 and B is 1, what will happen? See here, A is 0, A bar means 1, B is also 1. So 1 into 1 will get output as 1. Similarly, 1, 0 also. For the case, 1, 0 means here. A is 1, B is 0, B bar will be 1, 1 into 1, 1, right. If both are 1 means again it becomes 0, right. So output will be high when odd number of inputs, here only one input is low, here two inputs are low, so that we got low output, right. The output is high only when odd number of inputs are low, right. So for 0, 1 and 1, 0 we got the high output, for other cases we got 0 value, right. So the expression is A bar B plus A B bar. So it is used to implement magnitude comparator, gray code converter, adder, subtractor circuit, parity generator, module 2 adder, etc. So these circuits are implemented by the XR gate, right? Comparator, gray code converter, adder, subtractor, parity bit generator like that. Now we'll go to the one more topic, exclusive NOR gate. So exclusive NOR gate, right? So this is this is R gate. If you put one symbol, it is a NOR gate. If you put one more the circle here, it is X NOR gate, right? Exclusive NOR gate. What is the what is the operation of this? The output is high only when even number of ones at the input or all the inputs are high. The previous case we have odd number of inputs. Now here odd number of inputs are low, but here even number of inputs or all the inputs should be high, right? The output is high only when even number of ones or uh, even number of ones at the input or all the inputs are high. Previous one odd number of inputs are low. Here even number of inputs or all the inputs should be high, right? What is the expression for that y equal to a plus a plus xr gate be the whole bar a plus b x uh, x xr gate for that xr gate to the bar so it is nothing but a dot a bar dot b bar plus a into b so the previous case xr gate what is the expression a b bar plus a bar b here a bar into b bar plus a into b now we will see the truth table. The input, two inputs are there, A, B, output is Y. 
because of two input we have four combinations 0 0 0 1 1 0 1 1 if it is 0 0 what happened c a and b is 0 a also 0 b also 0 so total is 0 but here a bar b bar is there a is 0 means a bar will be 1 b is 0 means b bar will be 1 so 1 into 1 will get 1 output output as 1 then 0 1 0 into 1 automatically a is 0 b is 1 so this is become 0 here while taking complement 1 0 here also 0 right so 0 1 means in the both the cases we got 0 1 0 also same thing we will get the output as 0 because 1 into 0 0 here a is 1 mean a bar will be 0 b is 0 mean b bar will be 1 so 0 into 1 will will go okay we will get 0 only if it is 1 into 1 what will happen here 1 into 1 will get output as 1 right here 0 0 a is 1 b is 1 means a bar b bar will be 0 0 we will get 0 but here a into b is there right so due to that 1 plus 1 will get 1 right so what is the nature here we got the output as 1 only when all the inputs or even number of inputs are high right when the even number of ones at the input or all the inputs are high then only we'll get the high output right so for 0 0 we got the high output for 1 1 also we got the high output what is the application of this circuit it is used to implement even parity generator comparator even parity checker etc so it is used for this parity generator and the comparators so in this video we discuss about the derived gates nand gate and nor gate these are all also called as universal gate and special type of gate xr gate and x nor gate subscribe the channel for more videos and notification soft copy of this material available in the drive the link is given in the description box thank you for listening